Doctor, explain to us what happens to your heart during a heart attack and why is this happening every 40 seconds in the U.S.? Yeah, uh, well, let's start with the why it's happening because we have a society with a lot of patients, people rather, with risk factors for heart disease. So overweight, sedentary lifestyle, diabetes, high blood pressure, smoking, unhealthy diet. These are all the building blocks that then lead to the development of coronary disease, which fundamentally involves the, the accumulation of cholesterol, ultimately what we call plaque in the heart arteries. For many people, a heart attack is a manifestation of inflammation of the plaque in those heart arteries that then gets exposed to the blood flowing through the blood vessels and a sudden blood clot forming. It's a process that we call plaque rupture. Mm -hmm. um, so it's the most dramatic type of, of heart attack uh, where the artery goes from being mildly, sometimes moderately blocked to being suddenly completely blocked because of fissuring and rupturing of the plaque um, and a blood clot forming. And then that leads into the typical symptoms of a heart attack, which, which, we, can, which we can get to now. Um, so the typical symptoms of a heart attack include chest pain or pressure. Uh, the most, that is the most classic type. Some people can get less common, less obvious symptoms, sort of a vague shortness of breath, a feeling of sweatiness, what we call diaphoresis, just poor energy. Sometimes it manifests as nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, sort of confusing symptoms. Is this heartburn or is this a heart attack? Mm -hmm. But those are some of the more common signs of, of a heart attack. And, and unfortunately for many people, up to 50% of heart attacks present with what we call sudden cardiac death, which as the name suggests, you don't really get a chance to, <clears throat> to get to, to a hospital very, very quickly. Um, and that's why prevention is, is so important and that's why paying attention to the early warning signs and not dismissing them is also very important.